Amechi helped Mandela, told me releasing Namde Kano will bring peace in Southeast region, President Muhammad Buhari. So what difference did that make? Because you never listened to him. You refused to release Mazin Namde Kano. Now you are praising him. It's for words. It's of no use. Amechi would have been happier in his grave if you if you have released Mazin Namdi Kanu to him. He begged you. Not once, not twice, not thought. This man traveled all the way from the southeast to Abuja because of this matter. He refused. Because Namdi Kanu is not a Boko Haram member, he's not a bandit member. So for that. He's not in the book of those who can be released. Well, let's quickly hit the news and get the full details. But if you are just joining us, please kindly subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to give us a thumbs up. May God Almighty prosper you all. Amen. President Muhammad Buhari has disclosed what the late First Republic Aviation Minister Mbazurike Amechi told him about Namde Kano, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOP. Buari disclosed that Amechi informed him that releasing Kano will bring peace and stability and rebuild the Southeast. He spoke while eulogizing Amechi, whom he describes as a patriotic, whose character Nigerians should emulate for the peace and growth of the country. Represented by the Minister of Labor and Employment, Chris Ngige, the President spoke on Tuesday at a day of tribute organized in honor of Amechi in Abuja. The President narrated that Amechi accommodated the late South African President Nelson Mandela in his house in Lagos. Wari said that when Mandela was declared wanted by then apartheid regime in South Africa, he sought refuge in Amechi's house. He noted that such a gesture stands out the late Eda statement as a patriotic and lover of humanity. Wari said Amechi would be missed as his demise would leave a vacuum in the sand of history in the country. The president said, Mbazurike Amechi is an epitome of what every Nigerian leader should be aspiring to be. He was a man of peace and did everything possible to ensure that there is unity and peace in every part of the country. The unconditional release of Kano will not only bring peace to the Southeast, it will rebuild the trust of the people on your administration, Amechi Hart said. <laughs> so guys, what's your take on this? President Muhammad Buhari has disclosed what the late first Republican aviation, Republic Aviation, I beg your pardon, Minister Mbazurike Amechi told him, Hebratin Namdi Kanu, the leader of the indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB. Wari disclosed that Amechi informed him that releasing Kano would bring peace and stability and rebuild the Southeast. He spoke why eulogizing Amechi, whom he described as a patriotic, patriotic whose character Nigerians should emulate for the peace and growth of the country. Represented by the Minister of Labor and Employment, Chris Ngige. The president spoke on Tuesday at a day of tribute organized in honor of Amechi in Abuja. The president narrated that Amechi accommodated the late South African president Nelson Mandela in his house in Lagos. Wari said that when Mandela was declared wanted by the then apartheid a regime in, in South Africa, he sought refuge in Amechi's house, he noted that such a gesture stands out the late Eda state, statement as a patriotic and lover of humanity. Wari said Amechi would be missed 
as his demise would leave a vacuum in the in the sands of history in the country. The president said Mbazirike Amechi is an epitome of what every Nigerian leader should be aspiring to be. He was a man of peace and did everything possible to ensure that there is unity and peace every, in every part of the country. The unconditional release of Kano will not, will not only bring peace to the Southeast, it will rebuild the trust of the people on your administration. That was Mazi uh, Opa Mbaziriki Ameche. Good, at least you are saying this. What will people say about you when you are gone tomorrow? This is a legacy he has kept, and you are praising him. If you, if God decides to take you by tomorrow, what will people say about you? You refuse to listen to him. Now you are religizing him in that. What you cannot do for a man while he is alive, don't do or say it. When he is gone, I made you would have been more happier if you have released Mazin Namdekano to him while he is in his grave. But you are busy releasing your brother, the killers, and all that. You team them repented. Boko Haram and bandits and this and that. But you cannot deem individual Mazi Namdekano as a repentant individual to honor Mazi Amechi Mbazirike. Hmm. Nigerians go talk one thing. They say this life in no balance. Me, I even shock self say they talk this kind of thing. I'm dropping it here, guys. Kindly share your thoughts below.